you, Lauren, for coming and doing the interview with us. Thank you for having me. Great. Can you tell us a little about yourself? Um, sure. I'm from St. Louis, and I came out to D.C. for grad school and I work in communications. Okay, where did you go to school? I went to Georgetown. Wonderful. Okay. Well, um, just a few questions. Uh, how many events did you go to this week for CDC? Um, I didn't go to that many. I was really busy with work. Okay. So um, I went to a happy hour at Park on Thursday through the National Urban League Empowerment Reception. So that was nice. How would you say the energy was there? Um, it was great. Everyone was in a great mood and there was a lot of networking and it was nice. That was kind of like a kickoff of it. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. So what brought you to the brunch today? Oh, um, someone from, I uh, used to, I went to Salmon College and someone from okay. Morehouse um, was throwing this, so that's how I knew about it. And it was on the list of things to do for CBC weekend, so. Okay. Great. Well, we're glad to have you. Thank you for coming. So I just have a few questions. How do you feel Barack Obama is doing so far as president? Um, I think he's doing well. I think that, um, he needs a little bit more support, but I think he's doing well. Okay, how did you feel about when uh, Representative Joe Wilson yelled at you live during his speech to Congress? That was extremely inappropriate and disrespectful. Absolutely. Yeah. Conversely, what about when Lil Mama jumped on stage with JC? Um, very inappropriate. It's absolutely. Yeah. Right. Just not even respecting the way. I agree. I agree. So, tell me this. Do you think that Khalees deserves $95,000 a month? a little bit obsessive. I mean, you don't need, the whole idea of child support is supposed to be a child, and this is a baby who does not need $95,000 a month to make, make their family work, so I think that's a little obsessive. Just one last question, do you feel like the Congressional Black Caucus is something that a lot of young black people should make a point to come to? Definitely, um, it just kind of opens your eyes to new things that are going on. Uh, politically and socially, and I think it's, I mean, it's a great networking opportunity, so I think people should be a little bit more. Last question, I like. Have you ever been to thefreshexpress.com? I haven't. Will you go now? Sure. Great. Of course. Thank you. Thank you for your time.